my room. Sad, sad times. Can't believe I'm gonna just turn that down a bit. Can't believe it. First year of college basically finished. Um, today's fit. I am wearing jaded London brown tracksuit and then just my Oak boots, but like they badly need to be washed. And you said like you can get like, what is it? baking soda to put on your Uggs that it like gets rid of all the wetness and stuff the wetness gets rid of all the stains but I said I'm gonna do a little vlog I need to get back into it things happened in my life it was busy it was it was a time we had um, but I'm back now better than ever living my best life I'm currently on a healthy type of lifestyle for three days now lads I've put up with it for three days I feel like this could be the time because I want to be as confident as can be when going to Magaloo um so I'm actually going to Amsterdam next week of course I will be vlogging that and I actually got a few bits of clothes and stuff as well so I might do a try on haul woohoo um, I put a bit of instant tan because I am pasty pale as paper like it's so bad So if I was wearing this tracks, I was like no I have to put on the tan so I got these new headbands as well from ASOS loving them very Y2K you know how it is But we're going to the Crescent Excited <laughs> You look so funny when you're driving <laughs> but um, we're gonna go for lunch um, because I have literally been working five days a week I've only for my whole Easter holidays all I've been doing is working and this is my first day off so I am so excited but I'm so tired but I'm excited so I want to do something with the day so I'm gonna go present gonna go for lunch pick up a few bits it was payday today hallelujah so um, yeah I'll get back to you, you. Yeah, don't tell me. Um, so I'll get back to you on what is a story. And we brought suitcases and everything because I have so much clothes off in college and I need to do a massive clear out of my clothes. It's insane. Like I'm selling a load of clothes on Depop. I'll have my link down below if you want to get a sneak peek. Do you know how it is? So um, I'm gonna post a lot of things on there because I just, one person does not need that many clothes. I am a shopaholic, but it's kind of from COVID times when I was buying loads of clothes. Not really as much now because I can't afford it. But um, yeah, so I will catch up with you in a bit. Okay guys, we are back from the Crescent. I will do a little haul. I got actually a good few bits. My hair is a bit crazy. But we are in my college room. It is a bit of a mess because I was actually gone to race day and then I had work on the Friday so I had no time to clean or anything like that. Um, but it's gonna be so sad. We have to like clear out all my wardrobe get rid of everything like I am coming back like not next week the week after for two days and then I'm finished like completely so that is going to be very fun um but yeah no mom's here to help me now we might do should we do a collage mom I mean no a time lapse we may do a time lapse be ready Okay guys, we are making progress. We've one suitcase done, all jackets, and it's so empty. Guys, I actually didn't realize how much clothes I actually have until <laughs> packing everything up. How am I gonna sort this out in my wardrobe at home? But that's like three hours problem. Okay guys, so it obviously isn't fully done, needs to be hoovered badly, but it's so empty. Nothing. I have no jackets. Like my door would normally go out to here, I'd say, with all the jackets and the bathroom. But yeah, we're gonna go home now. Hello everyone. Don't mind the state of me right now. I've completely forgot to like vlog the last of my day yesterday as it was just a very rough day and I was not in the form to vlog at all. But we are back better than ever, getting it, mm. 
Just did a workout, hot girl summer, you know how it is. Um, got my Slimbo. I'm a, on a diet as well right now, believe it or not. I have been, this is day four, but yesterday I had polo pesto, but that was an exception. Yesterday was an exception to have the polo pesto. I deserved the polo pesto, but I'm having baraka you, and an iron supplement. Girls, get the iron into you. You know how it is. I don't have red meat, so get iron supplements and it actually makes such a difference. You're not as tired and everything and you're more awake, ready for the day with the Baraka and the iron supplement. I'm sorry, I actually look rough. Rough, but it's fine. Amsterdam on Tuesday, so excited. I'm gonna do some bed today and me and mom are gonna go to Dunn's. I'm gonna have my Slimbo now, my turkey sausages and chef's ketchup, of course. I have to have it with ketchup. And I'm gonna watch the new Keeping Up with the Kardashians. Okay, just came back from some beds and I'm already like, I don't know if you can see, but I'm already getting like the freckles on my face that I normally get, like just here. Um, and loving them that was second some bed and I took these um, tan tablets I'm so sorry how pale I am right now because I'm not putting my tan on till Sunday evening because of Amsterdam and stuff like that so I want to look really nice and bronze and nice tan so I literally don't have a scrape of tan on me just came back from the shops Got a few bits, healthy. I'm loving Coca Pops because they're actually good to have after a workout, best believe it. Um, because there's stuff in it to buy collagen or something. I don't know. Don't know what I'm talking about. Don't correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but yeah, no, so apparently and I'm trying apparently they're good and then I did my workout this morning. I just did a bum and an hourglass type of workout because I want to be confident and love myself in summer. So yeah, and I'm my holidays coming up as well, five weeks I think away, so I want to be at my best version of my body. So I'm going to really just, not like be strict, but like really not have like shit food and all that all the time. Um, but yeah, no, that's really, I've worked at three. Oh, dreading it, like, oh really don't want to go it's like when you are going to work it's like oh but when you're there it's fine but it's so annoying i really don't want to work today um but sure get the money okay guys actually i got this bar it's like a plant cadbury's no i think it's packaging it's on the plant based what is it plant bar it says plant bar. yeah um plant bar made with almond salted caramel mom thought the packaging was plant <laughs> This is where I get it from, people. Um, this is <laughs> this is a tracksuit I'm wearing today. Boohoo! Um, but it's vegan. I don't know. I went vegan for I'd say like two weeks or three weeks, wasn't it? And it was actually good. I did lose a bit of weight. I'm not gonna lie. And when I went um, gluten free, because when I get stressed, like I can't have gluten or something. Whoa, that smells good. John, try some. Get in and try it with me. No. Come on. Come on, come here. Mom, will you come here? Stop it. Come I'm here, mom. Mom. Let me try it. That's lovely. I try to avoid not looking at calories because I don't want to go down that road. But, um,. Per six chunks, there's only 122 calories, and that is unreal. Guys, really recommend that bar. That is lovely. Oh my god, so good. So get this bar, and there's like a few different flavors. I just wanted to get the almond and salted caramel, because I do love almond and salted caramel. Bless you. Oscar's um, sneezing. Really like it. Definitely get it. Okay, so I am on my way to work. I've done nothing really this morning at all. Um, so I've literally been watching like this new kind of series on Netflix. It's like unmatched, I think, but I don't know. I feel bad. It's a bit weird. I just think if you're going on that show, there's no point of being together. Let's be real because they're second guessing and stuff like that. Anyways. I made myself spaghetti bolognese for dinner um, because I'm on that health grind. I'm as pale as paper. 
Um, I have no scrape of tan on me, but I actually have kind of gotten it. I have um, tan lines now from the sunbeds. So, and I've only done two. So that's very, very good. I'm putting tan on tonight because we're going out tomorrow. I'm so excited. That actually reminds me. Thank you. Guys, you always got my back. I have to give a dress to a girl. We will sort our lives out later. Put the tan on. I wash my hair as well. My hair is actually getting long. Um, so that's a good sign. And it's getting really, really healthy as well. Sorry, keep looking up here. And I'm not looking down there. Um, but yeah, no. So we'll get our lives together tomorrow. I mean tonight. We'll do the tan. Help me pick out an outfit to wear for tomorrow. I don't know what I'm feeling. And then I kind of need to start getting ready to pack for Amsterdam. So we'll do that all tonight. I'm excited. J Ho, you are the reason that I still believe. Tan is done. Yo, guys, I've been, I've been a pale motherfucker for a really long time. So I'm feeling pr pretty bronzed in my pink shorts. Sorry, feet the toes. Um, I had a long day at work long long day at work and i'm trying to stay on this diet but like when i have this type of stuff in my house how can i we got the m&ms as well and guys i'm actually struggling i have no idea what outfit to wear tomorrow i know that's like not the end of the world problem but like it is stressful because tomorrow is is a night where i want to look good do you know what i mean Tough time never last. Only tough people last. Sorry. <laughs> um, that's not blended. But yeah, work did did do okay. Um, really not blended. Work was okay. It was fine. I'm in again eight to three. Then I'm gonna start getting ready. Like the minute I get home to be down at the pub for pranks around half five six and then into town um, Around I don't know. We'll see where the night brings us But then I have work at 8 in the morning the following morning God only knows what time I'm gonna get home My parents are in Dublin as well. So like Free house. I love having a free house because like no questions are asked after work. I love my parents and all but my god, the questions. It's the same questions every lad. This is not blended and I literally look like I have a black eye. That's how bad I'm not sleeping right now. Like I'm not sleeping at all. And it's so annoying. Um, you know when your like mind is just going 24-7. That is me right now. Like I actually can't sleep and it's like, oh I hate my life, but everything will be good. I'm excited for tomorrow. And I'll fill you in if anything exciting happens with my evening, but it won't be. But I'm gonna go to bed soon. Cause I have to be up at seven. My makeup is half done. I need to put my lashes on and stuff like that. I literally look rotten right now. But I am so hungry. And I'm going, I put on chick, turkey sausages, two waffles, and I'm gonna have some hoops or something as well. And this is the look for tonight. Um. I don't know what I'm going to do with my hair yet and I'll show you my outfit and stuff. I don't know, is it a bit fancy for tonight? Looks like I'm going to a pub first. Mm, I gotta see, I gotta see. But um, yeah, no, I am excited. But I feel so sick because I'm so hungry. Do you ever get like that? Where you feel so sick because you're hungry? That's me right now. And I haven't even had an Easter egg. I had no time because of work. And I'm working tomorrow at 8 in the morning. Um... So that is actually going to be so fun. I'm actually going to die. Die, but it's fine. That's future Amy's problem. Okay, guys. Alexa, stop. This is my outfit. Sorry, guys, about the music. I'm going to get copyrighted, but this is my outfit. Yeah, so excited. Sorry, I'm screaming, but I literally will get copyrighted right now. But yeah. Not good. Not good at all. 
I've only had two hours sleep. And it is a quarter to eight. Oh, guys. Do I actually regret Amy in the past? Yes, but I did have such a good night out. So do I really regret it that much? No. Sorry, excuse to me. Probably half my makeup is still on. Actually, these are the eggs I got. This. And uh, Lily O'Brien's. Cute little one. I haven't even had an Easter egg, but we're packing tonight for Amsterdam. And I'm working 8 to 3. Guys. Oh my goodness. I'm actually on. I did something to my back. Like it's so sore. So, I suppose life goes on. Hey, guys, I literally just woke up from a nap, went to work eight to three. Oh my god, was I hungover? I literally was working off like an hour of sleep, guys. My Domino's came. I don't know, I got like this buffalo pizza, but there's like so much sauce on it on the top like it could be really nice though but like i was not expecting that much sauce and i just got wedges chicken dippers and a um garlic dip but look my nails fell off and i'm going to amsterdam tomorrow so excited like i'm so so excited i look a mess i'm so sorry um but kind of appropriate because i am hungover but I'm gonna munch into this and then we're gonna go packing together. Mom said she'll help me because she's so good at packing and I always overpack. And I'm gonna watch the new series on. I'm gonna watch the new series on Netflix because it's like The Missing or something. Um, it's about like children, it's like a series. Children, um, I don't know, is it a true story? But let me see. The missing, it's like missing children and it's like, it's not real. It's like an actual series type of thing, not like a documentary or something. So I'm gonna watch that. 